Hi you guys, okay, I have been trying to upload this video for like, I'm not lying, two days straight. Um, I don't know why, but it's cutting my videos down to like four minutes. First it was eight. It shows here like 14, but <clears throat> I don't know. Some of them have to do this like in pieces, uh, you know, whatever. It's super irritating me, but... This was supposed to be a haul from, they messed up my order from Victoria's Secret, so they did replace one item that came to me. Um, uh, QVC got the package, um, I went to Ulta, the body shop, and then, um, Sephora. So I'm just going to get into this. This is a microderm abrasion, um, Um, system that you can do on your own. Now, I'm not sure if you all are familiar with what microdermabrasion is, but basically, if you go to your dermatologist and there's something on your face you don't like, you know, whether you're suffering from acne, whether you have sunspots, whether whatever the problem, you know, um, me and my friend used to go um, get chemical pills, and um, we also used to go to Bliss, which is like a spa, and um, out here, like in Los Angeles, there's one, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm getting kind of sick, in Hollywood, and um, before I veer off, because I do that, um, basically a chemical pill is where they put the solution all over your face, first they, you know, kind of um, look at your skin with a heavy duty um, magnified to the thousand power and they kind of like look at your skin and they decide what type of um well not what type but i guess the intensity of the chemical pill they're going to do for you they range from 100 125 and up i guess so my skin is not sensitive i don't you'd have to go to your own dermatologist to see whether or not you know um your skin can handle it mine obviously can't um, things, uh, just different things, certain chemicals will make me break out. That's my biggest thing, but my skin's not sensitive. I use pure retinol from Mexico, and, um, that'll make me peel. And I get the dead layers off, and I do that maybe once a week. Um, because if you go to dermatologists for that all the time, it's very costly. So, I haven't had a, a chemical peel in a while. <coughs> And my friend always used to get these microdermabrasions, but in order for it to look, um, for you to see a difference, um, basically the chemical peel is going to take all your dead layer off, maybe a little bit further than, you know, regular exfoliation. So, say you have like a brown spot or acne scar, it's going to minimize it, you know, really well, as long as you keep protecting your skin, taking good care of it. Um, at that time, it was probably like four years ago when my friend last did it, I was still out in the sun with no sunblock, and so, um, kind of got, you know, um, the sunspots, but I was using like a whole bunch of different things, um, stopping out in the sun for one, um, and kind of got my skin back into the condition I wanted it to, but, um, we do go to Bliss and we get the oxygen pill, oxygen facial, which is like they do this whole facial on you, it feels so good, and then it's just like straight oxygen shooting into your face, so your face plumps up, you're glowing, um, it's awesome, you need to try it if you have like one in your area, like, it's well worth the money, but anyways, going back to microdermabrasion, in order to keep up with that, um, each session is like 200 and up, so I just went and got this on QVC and I thought, well, you know what, I don't have to make appointments, I don't have to pay for it, I can do it, you know, um, I'm a mom obviously, and, um, you know, my husband, um, you know, there's things that I have to do, so I can do this when everybody's knocked out, dinner's done, and, you know, everybody's, um, you know, good to go, so I can, you know, take my me time, which is usually watching a movie or, yeah, you know, talking to my friends on the phone, but, um, I can, you know, do this, like, you know, 
when I have time, um, as many times as my skin can tolerate it, um, you can carry it onto your neck, um, so I, you know, went ahead and just said, you know what, I think this is a good investment, um, basically what it says this is going to do for you is soften the appearance of lines and wrinkles, which my skin is not bad, but I frown a lot because I squint, so I don't like these lines, I have a couple here, I squint, so I have some right here, these are hereditary, so I'm thinking of getting some type of filler, and I'd like to just ba barely plump my top lip. Not like Ange Angelina Jolie or nothing like that. Nothing where it's so obvious. I want it to be um, just, you know, uh, looking natural. But I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. I'm, I'm still kind of hesitant. But this is it will soften the appearance of the <clears throat> lines and wrinkles. Evens out skin tone. Minimizes the look of pores deep cleans your pores firms the appearance of your skin <clears throat> and brings the radiant glow back out of course because it's taking off all those dead skin cells that make your skin look grayish or just dull and blah because sometimes you think you have a really good exfoliator and um uh, you know it's really hard to find a good one i have a couple that i switch off back off and on to um from dr danessa's line she's like a renowned dermatologist um out of new york and i use a lot of her products she has like these um firming facial pads which i use also she has um a lot of good uh, serums to put on your face um for your neck for your hands um what i do with the firming facial pads and have retinol after i'm done i usually go over my hands because your hands will tell you know your age so I use um, philosophy exfoliating um, it's a exfoliating hand cream and I use the one by bliss and um, way east and those are like my favorites for my hands and my feet um, <clears throat> what else can I say about her line it's just really good she even has different facial pads for um, people that suffer from like you know if you have really bad sun damage or um acne scars um this will definitely um you know take them off so i'm gonna stop right here and then make another video because i don't know if it'll cut it off so this is my qvc purchase um yes it was kind of costly but if you look at it in the long run it'll save me money and time from having to go in and wait and you know get the appointment so I looked at it we'll see how it works out hopefully you know it um, improves my skin um, yeah so there's um, my haul from QVC which is not really a haul I just say it's a purchase and um, once I use it I will give you my honest opinion on it whether you know I got got <laughs> or whether I really enjoyed um, and I see results so I'll let you guys know when you know I try it so I'm gonna go and make another video really quick and um, it's a lot cooler here in California so I don't mind it right now it's just when it's hot so okay I'll be back right now thank you guys for watching